Hi guys! I uh, just thought I would do a quick video before I get started in the bathroom. Um, I've decluttered the half of the kitchen, half the dining room, the living room, and now I'm going to do the bathroom. I've got Kaylin in the bath at the moment, just behind me. So I thought I'll, I, I was just in with her and I thought I'll just hop out and get started on it. So I'll show you what it's like before I get started with the declutter. Uh, here you go. So uh, here it is as you walk in. I am just going to cover up for my little one who is Rudy at the moment. So if just a... Oh, just Kaylin came in and made a right mess. There's some magazines there that I probably won't even finish reading, to be honest. Uh, my toilet roll holder, that'll definitely be staying. There's a few cleaning products down there that I found when I cleaned out the kitchen cupboard downstairs. So they're just kind of waiting to be used up, really. And then I'll get some eco-friendly stuff. That's all random stuff that's... Honestly, it's been there for months. The windowsill the same as well. I don't even know if there's any wax left in those little tea lights. Um, so yeah, I mean it's not it's not like a pig site. It's not crammed because I have decluttered it a little bit. That's just a box of toys. Um, the buckets that we get our um, what do you call it? Dead sea salts in. So I've just used them. That one's a little step, and the other one's her toy box. Um, just cover her up. Um, the shower curtain's in the sink just to stop her from getting it wet. Um, there's just a unit there with loads of random stuff in. It's really old and tatty. Um, I don't really want to keep it, to be honest. I want to get rid of it, so I'd like to empty that. There's just random stuff in the drawer. The light um, fitting actually needs to go back up there. Um, it's probably all just broken random rubbish, to be honest. Down that corner, the other side of the sink, uh, there's a basket full of stuff, uh, a little box full of essential oils which I don't even use, and then a bowl full of stuff that I haven't used, so that's probably going to have to go. I do like the wicker baskets though, Just the, I'd like to keep the two wicker baskets and get rid of that tall one as well, just to open up the bathroom and be super, super minimalist. That shelf, it was really clear last time I did it, but... I don't know, we just dumped stuff on. We've uh, had to move the toothpaste up a level because Kaylin keeps getting hold of it and it's not good if, you know, if kids start eating toothpaste. That they shouldn't be. Um, that's inside the cabinet. Um, nothing really interesting, to be honest. Um, nothing that I really use that much. The essential, these, all this stuff here came from the dining room cabinet. If you watch that video, then you'll you'll see I, I just covered the the uh, windowsill in stuff that I had to move or rehome, and they got rehomed in here because they probably will will come in handy. So I won't get rid of those. And then stuff at the top there. That's my makeup bag, which never gets used because I never wear makeup unless I go out on a night out, which is probably like four times a year. And that bathtub looking thing is already full of stuff that I need to get rid of. So. I'm going to try and get on with it and I will keep you updated. Hi guys, we're just having a little break. Oh, I've got some... <laughs> oh, I'm covered in lip gloss and dinner. Um, she's she's found this and she's been painting me with it. Uh, <laughs> and painting herself, it's so adorable. But um, yeah, we've kind of ha we're kind of having a little break from the bathroom for a little bit while we get some lunch and have a bit of playtime. Uh, but I'm determined to get it done today. I'll be back later and I think I need to go and have a wash. Ew. Oops. Things were going so well and I've just tipped the aloe vera plant in the bath. <laughs> anyway, this is where we're at right now. Um, there's hardly anything on the floor. I'm just literally cleaning the place and then putting things back. Um, so... I will film again when I'm done. Accidents happen. Hello again. So um, I'm all done. I've minimised the bathroom. And you can see it, it It looks so much better. <laughs> so, so much better. Um, all that's left to do now really is I'm just going to give the floor a wipe down on my way out. And that's it. But yeah, I'll show you what I've done. So the... The wicker basket, I've moved it out of the room, haven't got rid of it yet, but I will be getting rid of that. 
Um, I think I can't remember if there was a lot of stuff on the windowsill or not. Looks very dark. Um, but yeah, I said I was going to keep those two baskets. Um, and, you know, they've come in handy just to, to put stuff in. I've put them on the windowsill because I don't want the toddler getting at any of it. Um, but they've, they have got a few random things in. There are a few things in here that I'll probably reconsider. You know, if I haven't used them in a, a couple of months or whatever, then I will probably, like, spare light bulbs. Just stuff that can come in useful. Um, but if I haven't used them in a couple of months, then I'll probably just get rid of them. Um, I obviously, you know, I, I use the things in here, so the spare light bulb. A bucket of wet wipes, I use that to clean the, the window and the mirror. Um, makeup bag, which doesn't really have anything in because I don't, I don't wear makeup, um, but I do need to get some more. And there's a, just a few tea lights just to save us going downstairs to get them if we fancy a nice relaxing bath. Um, the My salts, not salt scrub, sugar scrub, I made that myself um, and I plan on getting it used up and then I'll give that jar a a rinse out, maybe make some more, I don't know. Razor, a couple of toys that Kaylin plays with in the bath, which I'll probably get rid of because I've just ordered her some of those alphabet letters that you can stick on the tiles, so I think they'll be enough for her. Um, shampoo, conditioner, shower gel, that's really all I use. And then the cabinet, oh, down here, there's absolutely nothing down here now. Um, it was so dirty down there, <laughs> so dirty, but that's all um, like paint scuffs and things like that. Um, but yeah, it looks very, very clean and clear. Um, and the, the, um, the unit the, 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 where everything's stored, um, I don't really like having everything up at the top there, but they're the, they're the cleaning products that I need to get through um, still. Oh, hi. <laughs> The, um, the ones that I found in the kitchen, um, I've just put them up there just so they're out the way and then once I've used what I've got, I'll move on to them um, and then when they're all gone, I will move on to some eco-friendly stuff. So if you know, if you've got some products that you like that are eco-friendly, then let me know because I am looking for stuff. Um, inside that box there's just some dead sea salts, um, a body oil and a handmade soap which I will use once the shower gel's done with. Um, just a few kind of daily things that I use are on here. I keep my floss sticks out because otherwise I forget to do it. And then this is stuff that doesn't really get used every day but it, it, you know, it always comes in handy. Knit lotion, I've got lots of that. Just in case, you never know, and it's expensive and a pain to have to go out and buy it when the kids come home with knits. So <laughs> I've just kept all that, I've kept the essential oils that I like to use still. Um, that's the, the, the door handle isn't on, but I will get that sorted out. I've got an, a new door handle to put on, so that's just the inner in a bit of that just some creams that you know we use every now and again so yeah it's it's organized and tidy and it just feels a lot better you know i i would feel quite happy relaxing in this bathroom now um yeah i feel a lot happier i'll just show you the stuff that i've got rid of i've still i've, I've got some some stuff here now the the cabinet, that will be actually going back in that corner just to keep it out of the way until I can get my husband to take it up to a local farm to burn it. But the, the, he says that there's nothing to burn at the moment, so there's no point it going up there, but it will be gone. Um, just a few things down there. The, way, the scales, I, I never weigh myself. I just don't... I just don't. <laughs> I think it's a terrible habit to get into. A um, couple of things that I've I've got rid of there: incense stick, some weird bath thing, um, some soap that uh, I will take to a charity shop because it's a full packet, but it's um, it's full of chemicals, so I won't use it. Um, that's just a bin, um, a bucket, a couple of buckets. Um, that this here. This white basket has been at the top of the stairs for a long time. It's something I need to sort out. But it's um, 
if I don't know what to do with something, I usually shove it in there and I also stick the hoover in there just to keep it out of the way as well when I'm hoovering upstairs. Um, just some magazines and things that need to go downstairs. And then there's the um, the wicker basket waiting to go and I'm still undecided on what to do about the essential oils. I think I should get rid of them though because I, I don't use them really. So yeah, um, and that's just a like a travel bag i will be keeping that because that always comes in handy whenever we go anywhere and i do use it so uh there we go that is the bathroom so there's my bathroom declutter all done with um i probably get rid of more stuff as i go just to see you know it, it, whether i use it or not um i am getting a lot more strict with myself but the next thing that I need to do now really is get rid of all this stuff that's at the top of the stairs as soon as possible otherwise it will just sit here for months <laughs> like everything else so uh, anyway I hope you enjoyed the video if you did hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe if you want to catch my future updates see you later thanks for watching bye